Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I have a, a very exciting video for you. I'm going to be sharing a bunch of awesome products from small businesses today for your Christmas friends and family. So this video was happily collaborated with a bunch of small business owners from Etsy and a few other shops as well. So thank you to all of their shops for just sending such awesome things to share with all of my friends and family here on YouTube and Instagram. So make sure to send some love their way. I will link any coupons that they may have for me to share with you, as well as their shop links, Instagram links if they have them. So you can find all of these products very easily down in the description box below. So without further ado, I'm so excited because this is my first collaboration for a wonderful Christmas gift guide and specifically bookish gift guide, of course, since this is a book channel. Everything here is bookish and everything here is unique to the shop. There are no duplicates, so that's awesome. Everything is completely different from each item that I'm going to show you. So the first thing that I want to share with you is the Fierce and Strong box, which I'm so excited to share with you. And the Fierce and Strong box is a Christian book subscription box that you can get monthly and or I believe you can get them just by the one box as well. And they also have products from previous boxes. If you see something that you like from a previous box, they may have it on the shop as well. So you can buy them singly as well. So I have a coupon code, which is KD5 for $5 off your first box. Go check it out. Sylvia Nixon is the owner and she is just an awesome lady to work with. I love her. So I don't have November's box yet because we're snowed in. Otherwise, I probably could show you that one. <laughs> but I do have October's box, at least most of the products that I do have. So I can show you some of the items that come in. They are different every single month, at least as far as I've gotten them. So it's just awesome to see a bunch of unique items that she just gets together and comes up with an amazing box every month. So October's month was this book, which is The Warrior's Heart by Misty Emma Feller. And the next two months are actually the rest of the series. Uh, she usually has previous boxes as well, so you can always message her and see if she still has the October box if you want the entire series. So October's box came with this one, so November's should come with the second book. And then it also came with this adorable Fierce and Strong bag, and I do have everything. I think I'm missing one thing, and I just couldn't find it right now. I think it's in my journaling supplies. But it came with like a little prayer card with a little wooden block, so that was missing and I'll put a picture of everything that was included down in right here. It came with this gorgeous cross necklace. I absolutely love that. So it came with that as well, as well as this awesome t-shirt, which you can get in any size that you want. It says she is fierce, strong, brave, and full of fire. So I love that shirt. I can't wait till it warms up so I can wear it more often. I definitely will wear it more, more often. And then also comes with a handmade guided journal and planner, which S Sylvia Nixon makes these and creates these, which I think is awesome. And it has a beautiful velvety feel. So it is a daily planner plus like a daily um, kind of devotional question thing. So I definitely will be working in this as well in the coming year as well. So definitely be doing that as well as a fierce everyday magazine. So it has like journaling tips. And usually some things to kind of just pray over and introduction to the box and stuff. So that's really neat as well. So yes, if you use my code KD5, you'll get $5 off your, for, off your first box, which I think is awesome. All right, the next thing that I want to show you is from Tyler Shea Designs on Etsy. And she has these awesome bookish custom made t-shirts, sweatshirts, and mugs. And I just, I love them so much. I will definitely beginning more like once I have another list of favorites so I didn't wear the sweatshirt because I wanted to be all Christmassy today but you've seen me wear this sweatshirt in previous videos and here it is it has all of my favorite books this is all of my favorite uh I think YA and adult fiction so it has my top 10 I think eight top eight and there's also a muted tone which is really cool comes in multiple colors I love this shirt so much and is very warm so I can wear it during these cold winter months and then I also have the mug, 
which is exactly the same thing, only in mug form. And here is the mug. It has my favorite middle grade books on here. So these are all my favorite middle grades. And I definitely, I'm definitely going to get like a muted tone color too, because those are really pretty. I don't know if the mug comes in muted tones, but definitely the shirt does. So I love this mug and it's double-sided. So if you're a lefty or a righty, you can still see your books, which is awesome. So if you use the code Katie 15 for the book sweater and the mug or anything in her shop, she will give 15% off your order. Leave a message down when you're ordering. They usually have a comment message thing. Just message her your list of books. She'll even put it in the order that you want. So if you want like specific books in a, in a certain color, then she'll do that. She's awesome. So make sure to check her out. I will link all of her socials down below as well as her shop. So give some love to all these sellers. They're just all so awesome. I can't wait to share the rest of them with you. And I also forgot to mention, she does have those bookish sweatshirts in red and green books. So if you have your favorite Christmas list, you can get a book sweater or t-shirt and have red and green spines. I just think that's awesome. And so yeah, if you're a big Christmas fan of Christmas books, then this is perfect. And you can have all your favorite Christmas books, which I think is so, so creative and so fun. And that'd be perfect to wear during Christmas. All right, so for the next shop that I'm gonna be sharing, this is created by, well, that's her name, created by Kriya. And she makes some beautiful items. She makes um, book page holders. She makes bookmarks. She also has a lot of different things like coasters, cups, trinket trays, and keychains. So she has a little bit of everything. And these are all acrylic made from resin. Can't remember that word but she, she kindly sent me a couple of items to share with you all two bookmarks and two page holders i've used the page holder once i still need to figure out because i've never used a page holder before but i am enjoying it so far especially if it's going to be a heavier book i think it's going to be a huge help so she actually sent me two that actually kind of go well together which is awesome so she sent me this gorgeous blue bookmark it's gorgeous it's blue i love that color it's so pretty it's kind of like an iridescent blue, and that's actually my favorite color, which is like this kind of like aqua color. It comes with a tassel, and then she also sent me a book holder, which is kind of the same color, I'm trying to show you without showing my face. But it's this beautiful blue turquoise color, which I love. And then she also sent me some floral ones, which I love these floral ones. They're so pretty. But here's one kind of with like a yellow daisy. I love that, that's so pretty. And then she also sent me a bookmark. To, it kind of matches it, but it has different colors in it. And this is a clear one, so I'm trying to show you what it looks like, but it has, there we go. It has a couple different flowers in there with a blue tassel. Absolutely gorgeous, I love these. So I'll link her shop down below as well. So let's see, what is next? So many fun things. There's so many fun products out there, like just so many, so many fun things. The next thing that I wanna share with you is by the shop Di Capani and I love these. I think they're absolutely beautiful, but she makes custom infinity scarves and they're beautiful. And I got this one, which is kind of an illustrated bookshelf, which is her bestseller. It just has a bunch of books on here in bookshelves. I, I'm not sure if you can actually read any of the titles on here as they're muted, but you can kind of imagine kind of what books are on here which I think is awesome and it's an infinity scarf so it goes around and I just really love this you've seen both this one and the other one that I'm going to share with you I've shown both of these on Instagram so they're beautiful and definitely you can wear these all year long because they're not um they're not like cold weather scarves so you can wear these during the spring and fall as well so really pretty love this one and the other one she sent me is this black and white Alice in Wonderland print. I love it. It's got some of the phrases on it. Look how beautiful that is. I love it. And I love the wording on it, which is like that like, twisty twirly Alice in Wonderland. It's got the book on it. It's got this gorgeous, the rabbit. Uh, Alice is on here somewhere. Yes, she is. <laughs> there she is. There's Alice. So I think that's awesome. And on her shop, let me take this one off and show you the other one. But on her shop, she has a um, a listing on there on her shop. She'll go to her, go to her main shop, but she has a listing where if you add a list, if you add that listing to your cart along with whatever scarves you want to buy, if you buy two, you get 
one surprise item free. And if you buy three items, you get two surprise items free and you just have to pay for the extra shipping. So I think that's awesome that she offers extra goodies along with her shop. So here is, ooh, that's pretty. I don't think I've worn this one yet, have I? I can't remember. But yeah, that's really pretty. Actually, it goes quite well with the red, but gorgeous. I actually probably will be wearing this to church or something, but it's really pretty. Oh, I love that color. It goes well with the lipstick too. Super pretty. I love her bookish scarves. I think they're gorgeous. Also, for these beautiful Infinity book scarves, you can also find them on Amazon too. I will link both their Amazon and their Etsy shop in case you have a preference on which way you would like to shop. The next thing that I want to share with you is by Pickled Stamps over on Etsy and they sent me an embosser to share with you. I have shared this on my channel recently and I just, I love an embosser. I need to get cracking and emboss all the books I plan on keeping because this is what it looks like and I'll show you the stamp that was picked out plus a couple other designs that they have but they have a ton of embossers. They have a ton of ink stamps if you want self ink stamps instead of an embosser so that way you can see you know clearly this belongs to Katie or whatever. So let me go ahead and describe a book that I know I'm keeping and I'll stamp one for you. Okay so I know for a fact that all Joan Bauer's books I'm keeping so I'll go ahead and emboss this one. All right so I'm glad I picked this book because it's in blue instead of white so if you can see that there is the stamp beautiful love it it's got a little book it's got my name on it absolutely love it and I just love the feel of an embosser feels all bumpy feels good okay so I was able to emboss one more book off my bookshelves all right so awesome awesome pickle stamps thank you for sending this to me so if you like something simple and you know not really noticeable in your books embossers are great and the ink stamps if you want something bold saying this is my book then they also have that option as well and loads of different designs which i love so they also come in a little carrying case and easy easy to easy to put your your stamper in here because you do have to actually put it together but it's super easy i actually showed you on my channel recently so yes definitely check out their shop as well all right the next item that i want to share with you is actually one that i want in a giveaway but it is by a little shop owner and this is a custom book ornament and this is by Cara Bear Creations and I will link her shop down below. It's not on Etsy. She has her own shop, which is awesome, but this is, this is really, really a neat. So she creates these cute little books. They look like they're pretty sturdy too, because you can move this around. They're not going to get bent or anything. You can shake it up. And, but these are books that I love. Like, not just regular books, not popular books, but these are all books that, like, I absolutely love. And so, like, like yeah, like, you can see here, um, Nancy Drew is right there. Stop showing my face. <laughs> Nancy Drew is right there. A Place to Hang the Moon is right there. Um, we have A Crimson Cord by Jill Eileen Smith. The Princess Bride is kind of back there. So all these are most of my favorite books there's close to famous by joan bauer so yes so i actually left room in this to add more because i didn't have like a huge list of favorites of books but uh she does have different options for any amount of books that you want to put in here and you just send her a list of your favorite books and she will gladly make them which i think is awesome like i want her to make more when i have like extra books to put in here because i want this completely full or close to being full but I definitely had to hang this up on my tree this year. So super awesome, completely custom. I absolutely love this. And also if like you know your friend's favorite books, like you can say, hey, give me a list of your favorite books. You don't have to tell them what you're making. You can make them a custom ornament with all their favorite books. I think they would love that. The next thing that I'm going to share with you are in these two boxes. And these are by a New Leaf Candle Co. And she kindly sent me these two boxes and let me tell you, they smell amazing. I've already opened it. I've already smelled it. I have not used them yet because I had to show them in the video, but I will be enjoying these for sure very soon. So New Leaf Candle Co. And I will show you the ingredients list as well, but she has bookish smells, candles, candle melts, soaps amazing but she also has non-bookish smells so if you're not like a fan of like a bookish smell if you like flowers or other scents 
she has quite an extensive list and you can pick your color of soap so like if you see like different colors and stuff that you like you can pick what colors you want in the soaps which i think is awesome so you pick the color you pick the scent and she makes them and i love that about her shop i absolutely love that so without further ado let's open this and check it out with you all although i have already opened it i already know <laughs> all right so it comes in this beautiful packaging love that i love her packaging it's so cute she didn't have to go to all the lengths to make it super pretty but she did so cute little confetti i'll put that over there <laughs> so i don't make a mess all right so this is detergent free soap which i think is awesome these are the ingredients for the old library scent so you can pause the video and check out come on clear up I'm trying to give you the ingredients <laughs> but you can pause it and zoom in and those are the ingredients for the scent which is old library scent i mean come on come on old library scent so i'm definitely taking this out of the package so you can see them they are individually wrapped she sent me two in blue which blue is so pretty i love this color but i am going to open up one so you can see what it looks like on the outside oh it smells amazing i can't wait to use this in the bathroom downstairs but here it is okay so it's plain on that side but it's a book how cute is that it is a tiny little book oh that smells so good oh. so it does kind of remind me of an old library like it's kind of got like that like cedar kind of smell to it like a sweet cedar um, almost along with like smelling like there's certain books that kind of have like a kind of a sweet smell to them when you when you smell them if you're a book lover you probably know or you might know but it kind of has that smell too so i love that all right so that's the soap it smells amazing so she also sent me the same scent in there's also I can't remember the other scent that she has besides Old Library. Oh, it's Book Nook. I'm like, I need that too. <laughs> but she kindly sent me Old Library in the Candle Melts. Look at that packaging. How adorable is that? Whoops. It's upside down. <laughs> now you can see how pretty the packaging is. So again, I wonder if this smells a little bit different than the soap. I didn't smell them like next, side by side. Let's see. Okay, they do have a different scent. So this one kind of has like a sweet, almost kind of like, like a sweet kind, I really like this. So yeah, it definitely has more of like a, a cedar woodsy smell, but on more on the sweet side, this one is definitely like, like almost like old leather almost, well not old leather, but leather, like, you know, like, like how you sit like on a leather couch next to a fire. That's what kind of reminds me of. With a book mm, absolutely beautiful does it have doesn't have the ingredients in here but it does have instructions little warning label but yeah that's what it smells like and she also sent me a candle which is happily wrapped with my favorite flower all right so i can open this see i haven't even opened this yet so i can use it once i'm done with this video so here it is same packaging as the melt and i don't think i've even smelled this one yet Okay, this one smells very similar to the um, wax melts. So this one. But it's kind of in between. How, how weird is that? But they all smell amazing. So yeah, this one definitely has like a kind of a... Uh, yeah, just like a cozy cedar library that you would find a whole bunch of books and just want to stay there for hours. Love it. So those are amazing. Go check out her shop. It's awesome. And she also has Christmas and Autumn smells. So make sure to check those out as well if you're a seasonal smeller. <laughs> but yeah, so those were awesome. Such amazing products. I can't wait to use them because I had to wait until I filmed this. So now I can finally use them and enjoy them. I'm so excited to finally get to use them. Yay. All right. And then the next thing that I want to share with you is from Dystopian Prints on Etsy. And this is an adorable, I actually used it to carry some of my, some of my bookish things upstairs just now. But this is a gorgeous 
custom tote bag. It's really pretty. It says, when they saw the star, they rejoiced. Matthew 2.10. I love that. This actually is not in her shop at the moment. Um, by, the, by the time the video comes up, it might be, but she's got a ton of beautiful tote bags. She's coming out with some Christmas designs, which I think is beautiful. So it's just this really sweet tote bag. And I love the size of the arm straps. They're long enough to hold on your arm, which is awesome because I have pretty big arms. But nice and big. It's really big. I can easily probably, if I was like at a book sale, at a library sale, I could probably fit an easy 20 to 30 books because I'm a squeezer when it comes to library book sale. But I think it's beautiful. I can't wait to use this. I love tote bags so much. So if you use the code paperbacks ponytails, uh, you can get 15% 15 15 off your order. Keep on is good through December 14th. So make sure to order if you want this. She also has adorable, really beautiful faith um, stickers, which her stickers are amazing. They're, uh, they look like they're holographic. I absolutely love them. I think they're gorgeous. She also sells faith t-shirts. So she has a bunch of different items, which are all beautiful, all awesome. So definitely go check out her shop as well. And if you're, you are a reading journaler like I am, I love using a journal for, for doing my own layouts and because I am not a fan of like those reading journals that just have like a whole page for a book review. I can't do that. Like I write reviews online and I talk about my books on YouTube. I just cannot write lengthy reviews <laughs> with handwriting. So I create my own and this year I will be using this one. I'm so excited. I love bullet journaling. It's my favorite technique so far. And this one was kindly sent to me by Joie Things. She does have two uh, websites, one on Etsy and one is your own website. So I will link both down below as well. And if you use the code Katie 10, you will get 10% off your order as well. And that goes on through December 31st of this year. And the coupon is good for both websites. So it doesn't matter what website you order from. If you use that code, you will get 10% off. I do get a very small commission from them, but at no extra cost to you. But she just so kindly decided to do that. She's done collaborations before and she does that. So I was like, well, that sounds so sweet of you. Thank you. So that's awesome. And these come in so many colors. I'll put the color options here. So many colors, so many choices on foil. There's birds, there's flowers, there's travel icons, there's so many different options that you can get for your bullet journal. So I chose the one that has traveling, obviously, if you don't know me, I love traveling, but it has the world map and it has an airplane flying around the globe, which I think is gorgeous. So it also has her brand on the back, joyethings.com, but I love this. I've already done a huge review on it. I will link it down below in the description box if you want to check it out but a large band, which is heavy duty. I love that. And I'll share with you the pen test, which I did on the back page, but I did it purposely on like the second to last page. So that way, because this one's, I think more heavy, I can't tell, but I did the test and these are all the pens I tested out. I tested any, tested anything from a micron, distress markers, Sharpies, Posca pens, Tombow brush pens, zebra fine liners or mild liners. And I used an ink stamp as well to see if it could take anything. And it took anything. So she did say that Sharpies do bleed through. But honestly, there's nothing. I mean, maybe if you're, you're more heavy handed than I am. But there is nothing. There is no bleed through. There is no shadowing. There is nothing. This is the, I believe, 160 GSM. So it will take almost anything. Super heavy duty. They're so thick pages. I love that. Mine were so thin this year. I had to double tape them back to back. Yeah, if you saw that, that was bad. So I finally switched to a thicker journal and I love it. I cannot wait to share some of my reading journal spreads in here. I can't wait to use it. I, ju I just can't. I haven't done it yet, but I need to start writing in it. I love it. Okay, so check out her shop as well. All right, and the last product that I want to share with you, but certainly not least, is this awesome seller whose name is Queen Topaz Creations over on Etsy. I will link her down as well. All of these products will be down in the description box. So I'll make it easy for you so you can find everybody, find all the coupon codes, just to make it so easy for everybody because all these products are amazing. I would absolutely buy any of these for bookish friends, for family, although my family really doesn't read that much. But in general, if I had bookish family, yes, I would give them, give any of these items to them. So she kindly sent me 
such beautiful, beautiful items. So she has book sleeves and she has a new product coming out, which should be out by early December, I think. But this is gorgeous. So she has these adorable, this I'm going to share with you first, that she has this adorable little corner bookmark. And look how gorgeous that print is. Stunning. I love flowers. God must have told her I love flowers. All right, so I'm going to put it on the book so you can see what it looks like. And I'll just put it on a page, kind of in the middle there. I've actually never used a kind of like a um, paper, or not paper, I think it's made out of fabric, fabric bookmarks. So I'm, in, I'm intrigued. Oh, that's so pretty. All right, so I put it in there. I slid it on the page that I had. I love that. And it really doesn't like, it's not super bulky in your book or anything. I love that. Oh, I'm definitely going to be using this as a bookmark. I love that. All right. And then she kindly sent me, just put my book there. She kindly sent me a, a few of her book sleeves, one in each, one in each size, which I just, thank you so much for sending these. So we have the Kindle holder, which I want to show you because Kindles are Pretty much the same size going around but she sent me this gorgeous one in a blue floral print with pinks and oranges that's just so pretty and i love this one because it has a snap on the top so like you don't have to worry about your kindle falling out so that's what it looks like on the inside so it has a snap so you can close it so your kindle doesn't slip out <laughs> like it would in any other case it didn't have a snap and i thought that was a great detail and then I have the regular size book cover and I actually was looking online and I was like, I want this one. I love the print and she sent it to me. I didn't even know she's going to send it to me, but I love it. It's so pretty. Oh, I can't wait to use this in the summer and spring. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay. So this would probably fit a regular size paperback. So we'll put in this one, which is, let's see, tell you how many pages almost 350 pages almost so we'll see if that can fit in there and it does so this is definitely I would say for a regular size paperback to smaller I definitely don't think you can fit one bigger than this let me see I want to see if I have something a little bit bigger let's try Francine Rivers and see because she's a chunker so this one's like yeah over 500 pages I don't think it's gonna fit but yeah, it's too big. We won't even try. So definitely, I would say roughly about 350 pages or less would fit in the regular size one. And then she sent me the big size as well, which is huge. I mean, this thing is huge. You can probably, I don't know how big iPads are, but you can probably fit an iPad in here. I don't own an iPad. That's why I don't know. But this is huge. So this is an over 500 page book. Easily slips right in easily and it fits your giant book in here I don't think I have anything bigger than that one no I think that's one of my biggest books so definitely easily fits in over 500 page books so if you want to carry around those big hunker of monster books then definitely pick the bigger one and I'm sure you can obviously fit one of the smaller books I'll put the other one in as well so yeah I mean honestly even the small books don't look that bad in here it's just it's really big, but so that was for size reference. That way you all can see which is a different size. I'll also put them side by side so you can see the size difference. So here we have the Kindle, the regular paperback size, and then the large like 500 tomb size books that you can fit in here. Gorgeous covers. She has beautiful covers. She was so kind to send, kindly sent these to me. So I absolutely love these. I think they're gorgeous and I'm going to be using these constantly for sure. And so Thankfully, I'm done because somebody just started a snowplow out there. So thank you to all of the wonderful shop owners for collaborating with me on this video. I just feel so blessed and thank you so much. So make sure my friends and family to give them some love, you know, put a heart on their items on Etsy, shop for your friends and family because I love buying from little shop owners and Etsy because you know you're you know you're supporting small business owners and I just love that. So make sure to check all of these wonderful shops out and I will see you all in the next video.